Harry, did you get your book? Yes, Mrs. Weasley. I can't wait to try out what I've learned. Where did you lose your things, Ginny? I think I dropped my brass scales when I passed the fireplace in the magical menagerie. My new quill definitely fell into the back of Gamble and Jake's. And I'm sure I saw Hagrid when I lost my spell tape. So I think that must be in the Leaky Cauldron. Hmm. Magical menagerie, Gamble and Japes, and the Leaky Cauldron. Gossip. We really appreciate this, Harry. It is so kind of you to do this for Ginny. Yes, Harry. Thanks so much. Now go on. Show us what you can do with your new spells. Bet you can smash those barrels over there. Yeah, so those are supposed to be hints. Goodbye, Ginny. We're gonna waste time finding your crap. Yep, sickles. I'm gonna go all the way to the end and start from down there and work my way all the way to the leaky cauldron. Ow! Sorry. Alright, so 11 sickles. Now, we don't need every sickle in Diagon Alley. I'm not sure what the remainder amount of sickles you can go up to is, but... You don't need every sickle, but I'm collecting every sickle in Diagon Alley anyways. What's this shop? Uh, robes for all occasions closed, and now we're going to Nocturne Alley, which is still considered Diagon Alley for some effed up reason. Yeah. Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure there were barrels down here somewhere. Is it? I thought I. I thought there were. Oh yes, there is. Can't get through there. So that's where we came out of, and now we can't go in there. Okay, so uh, we just came down there for those three sickles. So now we're gonna process going through Diagon Alley, finding Ginny Thane's, uh, Ginny's Thane's, and getting that potion vial. Yeah, so as you can see, this is Green God's Bank. We can enter it. Wow. But the thing is, later in this game, we can actually go inside Green God's. When? Well, you need the Game Boy Advance in order to activate it. Now, since I've already activated it, I can enter Green God's later in Hogwarts. However, I might show you later, near the near the end of this Let's Play. So, Mr. Mall Pepper's, uh... Uh, whatever that word was, but I think this is the potion shop, I believe. So this is where we'll be getting uh, Harry's uh, potion vial, and we'll be finding the rest of Ginny's things. Excuse me, how much is this potion vial? It costs eight sickles. I'd like to buy that, please. Thank you. You're very welcome to fill your potion file with Wigan World Stamina Potion. The Wigan World's in the Large Cauldron, over there. Yeah, so this will be used almost like the fairies in Orcarina time. <laughs> so if we lose health all the way, then we use the Wigan Well Potion to stand up and fight again. No way through there. Okay, I'm just making sure there's... Bless you. I'm just making sure there's no more uh, stuff around here that we need to get. No, it was just the potion vial. Now to find Ginny's things. You know, as much as you would want to complain, Ginny, go find your own crap. Well, don't complain because Ginny's not only going to be Harry's girlfriend, but, uh, spoiler, yes. Okay, the magical... Man, uh, manager, manager, I don't care what it fucking says. I just want to get Ginny's things and get out. Is it just me or is the loading going slow? Whatever. We are closed. I'm feeding the sock. Keep out. Well, if you're closed, then lock your doors. Three barrels, one sickle. Weird slug. Didn't you hear me, boy? I said 
We're closed now. Go away. I don't know kids today. Well, that guy's such an ass. Harry, why don't you at least tell him that you're looking for something? And maybe he might let you look for that thing. And see, Harry's still there, and he just ignores him and just walks past. If I can just keep quiet... So this is our very first sneaking game. Whoa, is that an eyeball? <sighs> That's creepy. Flubber worms need feeding. Now that's creepy, an eyeball. I wonder if the noise of a spell might distract him. Okay, I thought we can shoot spells down there, but I don't know. What was that? Okay, I'm not sure where the hell he is. If I can just keep quiet. go got a wizard card and Ginny's thing is just in front of the Number fireplace Tilly Toke Tilly Toke gained order of Merlin first class for saving the lives of non-magical tourists during the ill famicom incident of 1932 when a dragon swooped down on a beach full of sun bathers sounds weird Ginny's brass scales! Alright. Now we have to uh, make our way out. Who's there? Your mom. And stay out of my shop! <gasps> <sighs> what an ass, don't you think? Yeah, so that's what happens like during Hogwarts because there's prefects that are just like him that will show the loco loco mortis or whatever the spell's called. Yeah. And uh what? We start back here. I thought we go out the front, damn it. So we have to sneak past him in order to get back. Bye, you asshole. Yeah. Yeah, so we will be facing that during Hogwarts, at, mostly at night time, when we're sneaking past prefects. And of course, when we get caught by prefects, then we it reduces our chances of winning the House Cup. Now, I'm going to be fully honest, I have never attempted to lose the House Cup. Or well, what if you, whatever happens if you lose it. What? I thought you couldn't enter there again. I thought it, it closes as soon as you get whatever you need to get in there. I guess not. Anyways, I'm just going to get my ass out of there once this is done loading. Okay, so now we're going to be going to Gamble and Japes. Yeah. So the reason why I'm doing this LP is because some uh, f a few Let's Players that I'm following have been known for liking the Harry Potter. So I decided to do Harry Potter so that way, I don't know. So if they gain interest then they might come over here and, you know. It's kind of the whole thing of collaboration when it, we're not actually collaborating. If that even makes sense. Anyways, enough spamming. Gamble and Japes Wizarding <laughs> Joke Shop. So, let's go find Ginny's things. Nice music here. How much are our stink pellets? Full sickles for a pack of tin. Some stink pellets! Yay, some stink pellets! Okay. So if we throw them, 
<laughs> It'll make people cough. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure some of you are asking how far did I get the first time before this whole thing failed. Can't get in that way. I pretty much got as far as uh as pretty <coughs> pretty much at the end of Diagon Alley. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Yay. Any more things we need? Whoa. That was unexpected. Please note that I do not have this game in... I don't know this game by heart, so... I mean, I memorized as much as I can from my childhood, so... I'm not sure how much I'm gonna remember playing this. But I'll do the best I can. Okay, there's nothing back here, so what's the point of back here? It's always good to look around before you even uh, think of leaving the shop. Now, I know there's a secret up here, which I'm pretty sure some people might be missing. So some of you who have missed this, well, there you go. I've showed you the secret. Uh, sh what am I here for? Anything? Oh, chest. With a wizard card in it, so good thing I came in here. Number 32. Bridget Wenlock. And I don't care what she's famous for, because I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to hear me read it all day. Yeah, I think we bought in everything in Diagon Alley, so... Over 16 is the remainder that we have left. And I'm pretty sure there's more once we head to the Leaky Cauldron. There isn't a particular order that we have to do after we get the grade book and get Ginny's Thanes or Harry's Potion Vial. It's mostly just whatever. So, Eyelops, Owls, Closed. Why is everything closed around here? Seriously. And the shops that I'm supposed to go to are all open. So, the Leaky Cauldron. The Leaky Cauldron, that's in London. You hear that, Ellen? The Leaky Cauldron, that's in London. The Leaky Cauldron. Hey, if you're gonna have some pea soup, make sure you eat it before it eats you. <laughs> hey, Grid. Did I tell you, I've been having a bit of trouble lately with flesh-eating slugs. Really? There's more than butterbeer down in the cellar, you know, Mr. Potter. There is. There's more than butter beer down in the cellar, you know, Mr. Potter. Okay, if that's all you're gonna say, then I'm not interested. Oh, watch how he cleans. <laughs> he sneezes and wipes the counter. The Leaky Cauldron's the finest pub in London, Harry. It's got a huge cellar, you know. <coughs> Excuse me, um. Sorry. So, how do you clean that? Okay, I'm definitely not drinking from this pub again if you're going to be wiping your saliva and mucus all over the cups. Okay. Well, there we go. There's Ginny's uh, last... Um, uh, this telescope... I ah, no! <laughs> oh, why did that have to happen? It was just there. Damn it. Yeah, if you haven't noticed at the bottom, we have different flavor beans, so... Usually the green ones are the most disgusting ones, so phlegm is an example. Uh... There we go, so now that it's closed tight, the next time we walk across that, that thing won't open on us. Why the heck was it open in the first place? Okay, 
so these enemies get very, very annoying, just so you guys know. Underpants, cinnamon. These enemies get very, very annoying. You know, this game pretty really does have some awesome music. Alright, uh, what do we have down here? Plum. Wow, Harry, you're seriously going through a lot of trouble. <clears throat> I remember, or actually, I recently have watched The Chamber of Secrets because I'm trying to watch all seven Harry Potter movies before seeing The Deathly Hallows Part 2 on Thursday, or I mean Friday. And to th think, he's really gone through a lot of trouble during the Chamber of Secrets movie. In my opinion, either Chamber of Secrets, Order of the Phoenix, uh, okay, I'm gonna be naming a lot of movies because I really do like Harry Potter. Chamber of Secrets, Prisoner of Azkaban, Goblet of Fire, and the Order of the Phoenix and the two parts of Deathly Hallows are definitely the best Harry Potter movies. But Nitsa, you never seen the Deathly Hallows part two. Oh, but I will, and I know it's gonna be great. Did I tell you I've been having a bit of trouble lately with flesh eating slugs? I am never gonna drink from those cups. The Leaky Cauldron Cellar is a great place to explore, Mr. Potter. Yeah, I've been down there. It's shit. Jenny Spellote! Yay! Now I got all of Ginny's things. Now I don't have to be her slave. Okay, so I've almost recorded for about an hour, so that's pretty much the estimate of how much I recorded the first time before this failed. It was pretty much at the end of Diagon Alley before I stopped. Good thing I did. <laughs> 